I'm Spartacus! 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 That guy's Spartacus. I'm not Spartacus. What's up, guys? I am Doug DeMarco, and I got a beer and an unboxing. So let's unbox some stuff, man. All right. We have Dungeon Crate. And uh, if I remember correctly, this uh, the theme of this is something to do with Shady or something like that. Not entirely sure. Let's crack her open and see what we got. All right. And, uh, in case you haven't noticed yet, I got a new hat. All right, all right. Okay, and on top is our card, which has something new on the back each time. This looks like a nice four-way. Okay, that's cool. And we'll save that for last to make sure we got everything. We have an adventure that is, uh, ooh, this is more than a couple pages. What is this? Uh, one, two, three, four, so about 16 pages. This is a shady situation. Got a nice uh, proper booklet. Eesh. Let's check out some of the art in here. We have uh, Bonnie LeBlanc, the shady lady herself. We got some nice pictures. I like pictures. A little map. Nice little cartography. And uh, eh, some other stuff. Ooh, some bad guys. Some pirates. Let's, uh, let's see what the synopsis is on this. Bonnie LeBlanc, owner of the Shady Lady Tavern, is having a monumentous birthday and a party to match. A cask of special whiskey she ordered from friends up north has not arrived, and word of trouble spreads. People stealing my alcohol. Bonnie enlists adventurers to escort her north to the distillery and help discover what has happened to her precious booze. That is a quest worth undertaking. There are noble aspects in every campaign. Some of them more noble than others. <laughs> All right. And it looks like we got some boats. We got two boats, one uh, double-sided. These will go nicely with uh, those other ones that are three-parters. Some nice uh, little boats on the side. I like me both. I like me some boats. I would like a nice long pirate adventure. So we got some tokens, and I believe uh, our elevated part from that was missing from the last box. Let's crack this open and see if my engineering skills can be put to the test. Can we actually put this together? One hour later. That wasn't so hard at all. No. All right, and we have our elevated platform. Check that out. And, well, just enough space for a miniature. Just like that. Check that. It's a nice little course for elevation in case he decides to fly and come and get you. Okay. And the tokens now. We have three wooden tokens. There we go. Yeah. Three of them. But on one side, it's a treasure chest, and on the other side, it's a mimic. Oh no! No one ever expects the mimics in a treasure chest of all places. <laughs> okay, and we have a... this is a d20? No. No, it is not. Ooh. This is a d24. I don't know why you would need that extra four, but you have it just in case. So nice gamer science. D24 in purple. I like purple. Then we got something in a bag. A little light. I think it's uh, I think this might be dice two or something. And it's knotted. I'm trying to keep me from my stuff. Ooh. Lords. Lords help me. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got some barrels been wondering if they were going to put these in. This is not from Dungeon Crate. Obviously, obviously it's from Dungeon Crate, but the maker 
We'll look on the card for the who the maker is, but these are some really nice barrels. Just for some, you know, just for some dungeon ambiance. You know, from for casks or whatever. And these come neutral, so you can paint them or stain them. I would probably stain them since it's a wood into whatever you would like. And uh, they're nice enough, they could stack on each other. That's pretty cool. All in all, a really nice addition. And I had seen these on their uh, Facebook previously, but I never ordered any. But now I have them. And we have some miniatures. These are from Dark Haven. This one is, ooh, she's a little saucy. The Townsfolk Strumpet. Look at her. Right, there we go. The Townsfolk Strumpet. Now, as a man of much verbiage, I do enjoy uh, some words you don't really hear all the time. And strumpet is definitely a uh, bygone word. I hope it makes a comeback in a, more of a flattering thing. Anyways, we have a lizardman spearmint, also from Bone Stark Haven. And he is upside down. Good lords. Alright, here we go. A lizardman spearmint. To go along with our strumpet. And we have. Who are these coins? Because I do enjoy coins. In a little velveteen bag. This is heavy. Ooh, these are really nice. These are inspiration tokens. And these are a nice, heavy, heavy metal. Three of the same kind from. 1980 who Boosh. Uh, let's get that stuff back here. And uh they're not they're slick on the back. You can put whatever you want on there. But these are really, really nice. I mean the only thing that would make this I don't know more nice would be if they were double sided, but uh double casting has got to be expensive. So, in a box like this, man, these are these are really nice. Nice inspiration tokens in a little velvet bag. Let's put those back for protection. If I can pick them up. Success. And last but not least, we have a big D20. Why, why are you not opening? What's wrong with you? Okay, there we go. What's this, like a marshmallow? A, a candle? Ooh. Oh, that smells nice. What is this? This is a D20 bath bomb. Made exclusively for Dungeon Crate. By some very, very tiny writing. That I will read from the card. Alright. Used by December 20 of 18. I think I will be using this before then because uh, I like to pamper myself a little bit and everybody deserves some pampering. Okie dokie, and I believe that is it. This was uh, a pretty hefty crate with a lot of stuff. Let's, uh, yep, nothing hidden, just a bunch of uh, fire warning. So let's look at our card and see. How much of everything we got? <clears throat> Ooh, lords. Man. Alrighty. Summer is here, and we have a fantastic crate lined up for June. This month, we showcase new upgrades with a heavily expanded mini module, dungeon tile insert, and an additional art terrain insert. Venture north with the shady lady herself and enjoy a crate filled with stuff to make you feel good, shiny things to inspire you, and tiny things to adorn your gaming table. Alrighty, so let's, we got our D20 module, A Shady Situation. We have our three metal inspiration coins with the bag from 1980 Who. We have our Shady Lady Mini, which is the uh, Town Strumpet <laughs> from Reaper Miniatures. A set of three mini wooden barrels from Dungeon Crate. Let's uh, look at this a little more. 
A set of three wooden barrels finished to add to your tabletop train or tavern. You can also use them as props to flatten it included. Now they didn't include a maker, so this might be in-house. Our D20 bath bomb from Fizzy Fairy Apothecary. That kind of rhymes. Fizzy Fairy Apothecary. For all your bath bomb needs. Well, we have our reptilian miniature from Reaper Minis. We have our terrain card times two for our little boat. We have our single D24 from Gamer Science, our non-standard die, and our digital crate, which I will look at later. Also, if you guys are interested, uh, I don't mind spoiling what's on the digital crate if you guys want to see uh, what extra bonuses are there. Somebody had asked me previously, you know, hey, you mentioned the digital crate, but you never say what's in it. And, you know, I don't mind spoiling it a little bit if everybody, you know, if you're on the fence about wanting Dungeon Crate and you want to know what's in the digital crate, I'll let you know what's in it. You know, I'll, obviously I won't give you the password for it, but I'll let you know if it's worth your time. Because uh, nobody likes to waste time. Ain't nobody got time for that. All right, guys. Uh, that was it for this Dungeon Crate. There were a lot of stuff in here. A lot of great stuff, too. You know, we got our, uh, our die, a couple minis, and a full adventure. Which is uh, pretty interesting. I don't know going forward if they're going to include those in all boxes. But uh, I'd, not, I'd like to see at least one in every three. That'd be pretty awesome. We got a bath bomb. We got some inspiration tokens. We got a little bit of everything. Let me know what you thought of the crate, guys. Alright, thanks for watching. And you be awesome. Just a right